you shoot while the shirt was out. Did she actually shoot? A documentary set to premiere in October telling the story of China Color's life. The 24-year-old was shot to death in the Paxton area of Jacksonville by her ex-lover. Color's mother says the worst part is her grandchildren she's now raising without their mother and father because he died too. Death isn't telling me. Death can knock on anybody's door. Tiki Stafford says she never realized the extent of the abuse her daughter was experiencing until after she died. She says her daughter filed several injunctions against her ex and also called police to their home, but she did not think domestic violence would end her life. Domestic violence is happening more than it used to happen, and it's, it's, a, it's a silent killer, and you know people need to talk about it. In October, Remembering China Color will premiere in private showings in Jacksonville and several other Florida cities. The documentary is meant to raise awareness on domestic violence. As Color's story is told by several of her loved ones, her mother says she hopes people understand love doesn't hurt. If somebody can watch a documentary and it touched them and it, you know, put it in their heart and give them a the strength to want to change the way that they're living, even for us, the men. You know, you got men being abused, too. It's not only women. Destiny McKeever, First Coast News, on your side.